A man is dead after a standoff at a Winco parking lot in Antelope. It happened just hours ago during a busy time for shoppers. ABC 10's Van Chu is live at that Winco tonight. And Van, you just got updates from deputies. Bring us up to speed. Well, the crime scene has just been cleared. It happened at this busy parking lot at this Winco Foods, which is also next to a preschool. What started as a call of a suicide man with a gun is also now being investigated as a deputy involved shooting. A standoff outside Winco Foods off Alberta Road ended with a man dead in the busy parking lot. Everyone in the store freaked out. It was really loud. Shoppers kept away by overturned shopping carts used as barricades as deputies had their guns drawn on a man who was suicidal and had a gun pointed to his own head. I came to the Winco just to get some bread for dinner for my family and I saw all of this just so crazy. It's really sad. Around 3.30 p.m. the Sacramento Sheriff's Office had 911 callers reported the man appeared to be a transient. When law enforcement arrived, authorities say the man shot himself in front of them. At some point, a deputy also fired a service weapon, but it is unclear if the bullet struck the man. The SWAT team called in after the shooting, since the man still had the firearm in his hand and appeared to be moving. Anything could have happened. It's crazy out here. The standoff forced a lockdown at the nearby preschool. Parents relieved they were soon after able to pick up their children. And because this was a deputy involved shooting by protocol, the deputy will be placed on paid administrative leave. Homicide detectives will be leading this investigation, but it will also be reviewed by the inspector general and the district attorney's office.